What's better, Spider-Man's kiss or sweet churros? She'll eat me cake! You stay here. I'll go get some tea. Trim a chocolate sponge cake. Melt white and dark chocolate in a microwave. Cover the whole cake with white glaze. And write, eat me with dark chocolate. Mmm, here's a nice treat for me. Stole my cake! No! You give that back! Oh wow! What's going on? I think I'm getting bigger! It's a hot day by the pool! Here's Steve Harrington! Look! Something wild is about to happen! I bet you I'll get free ice cream again! Put peeled bananas along the sides of an oval plate. Place scoops of vanilla, chocolate, and fruit ice cream between them. Put in triangular wafers to look like the sails of a ship. Cover the ice cream with sweet topping and whipped cream. Decorate the sundae with sprinkles and cherries. The USS Sunday from Scoops Ahoy for the lovely lady. Steve is charmed. <laughs> this is my fourth day of free ice cream in a row. You need to keep an eye on your order when you go to a magical cafe. We ordered beer, but this beer seems kind of buttery. Heat up non-alcoholic beer in a pot, but don't let it boil. Add spices, cloves, cinnamon, ginger, and nutmeg. Mix two egg yolks and two ounces of brown sugar. Beat it with a mixer until it turns white. Pour the mixture into the beer. Mix quickly so the yolks don't cook. Add butter. Beat the beer again with a mixer. Pour it into a glass. Put the foam on top and serve it hot. Hang on, is our waiter THE Harry Potter? Now I understand why this beer tastes so buttery. This place makes the best shawarma in New York. This is the Avengers' favorite cafe. No way, is that Tony Stark? Whoa! It really is! Iron Man is waiting for his shawarma! Season a chicken breast. Fry it. And cut it into strips. Lay out a piece of lavish bread and put lettuce, tomato slices, chicken, french fries, and sliced pickles on top. Grate some garlic. Add it to plain yogurt and salt it. Pour the sauce over the filling. Roll the lavish up. And fry it on a dry pan. Mmm, delicious! You're right, Tony! This is the best shawarma in New York! 
Spider-Man, you saved me again! And vanished again! All I can do is wait for you and eat your favorite churros! Pour one cup of water into a pot. Add a quarter teaspoon of salt and two tablespoons of sugar. And half a cup of butter. Let the mixture boil. Decrease the heat and gradually pour in four and a half ounces of flour. Mix dough. Take it off the heat. Beat three eggs in one by one. Mix the dough well every time. Put the dough into a pastry bag and squeeze thin strips of it into a pot full of hot oil. Fry until they are golden. Take them out and put them on a paper towel to soak up the excess oil. Mix sugar with cinnamon in a plate. Coat the churros in sugar. And put them in a paper cone. Oh, there you are! Here, take a churro! This is such a sad tea party! Until Paddington Bear shows up! And he brought toast with orange marmalade! Squeeze two big oranges. Separate the flesh from the peel. And put it in a bowl with cheesecloth. Tie it off. Cut the peel into thin strips. Pour the orange juice and one cup of water into a pot. Add the sliced orange peel and put in the bag with the orange flesh. Cover the pot and let the mixture cook for 30 minutes. Then take out the bag with the pulp and squeeze it. Pour in 14 ounces of sugar and let it cook. Add cinnamon. Cook the marmalade on medium heat for about an hour. Check if it's done. If a drop doesn't spread on a plate, that means the marmalade is ready. Pour the marmalade into sterilized jars. Thanks, Paddington! This little bear can eat a whole jar of marmalade by himself! Bon appetit! Cafe of Thrones? Hey, Daenerys, can't you see who's here? Sansa Stark herself! I want my favorite lemon cakes! Separate three eggs. Add four tablespoons of sugar into the yolks and beat them with a mixer. Continue beating and add four tablespoons of water and one tablespoon of lemon juice. Add a pinch of salt to the egg whites. Beat until they form stiff peaks, adding four tablespoons of sugar. Mix eight tablespoons of flour and two teaspoons of baking powder. Add the flour mix to the egg yolks. Combine them with the whites. Add the zest of one lemon to the batter. Coat a cupcake mold with vegetable oil. Fill the molds three-fourths of the way. And bake the cupcakes for 30 minutes at 355 degrees. To make cream, mix four yolks, four ounces of sugar, the zest of one lemon, four ounces of lemon juice, two ounces of butter, and two teaspoons of cornstarch in a pot. Mix well and cook on low heat until it thickens. Add 3 fourths ounces gelatin, dissolved according to the instructions, and let it cool. Pour the cream into the molds, filling them halfway. Put the cakes on top and place them in a fridge to cool. When serving, flip them cream side up, then decorate them with berries and lemon zest. Go play!
away, my little dire wolf. And here are my special lemon cakes. Just like we make them in King's Landing. Oh no! The dragons are sneezing again! Alita! Battle Angel! I'll show you what life is like! Want an orange? It's too bitter! Okay, try some chocolate instead! Melt milk chocolate. Pour it into a chocolate bar mold. Even out the layer and put it in the fridge to harden. Draw the logo of the corporation from the movie on the hardened bar with melted chocolate. Let it cool. Adjust the shape with a modeling tool. Wrap the chocolate bar in gold foil. Chocolate tastes way better! Even cyborgs like chocolate! Did you like our recipes for your favorite movie hero's favorite foods? Comment below what food you'd want to try from what movie. And you guys, subscribe to our channel, like this video, and click on the bell. Don't miss new movie recipes from Troom Troom.